Daniela and today I'm gonna share with you how to make these uh, braided leather bracelets. These ones have a magnetic clasp so it's easier to take on and off but of course you can also use any clasp that you have. Uh, you only need to match the width of the clasp with the width of the cords. As usual, don't forget that the supplies are all listed in the description box, so if you have any questions or doubts about what, which thickness of cord did I use, you just have to check it out. And let's get started! Start by cutting 4 cords with 1 meter and 40 centimeters, and a smaller cord with just 40 centimeters. Clip both ends of the smaller cord onto a piece of cardboard to hold it. This first part is probably the hardest to explain because it's the starting point and part of the cords are still loose but you'll see this is actually very simple and very similar to a normal braid. Place the strands over the cord and separate them into pairs like this. Starting with the top left cords, bring them under the one in the center and into the middle of the section. Crossing over the cords at the bottom. Then do the same with the right cords, bring them under, in through the middle of the left cords and cross them over the cords at the bottom again. Tighten it and repeat the process. Bring the left cords under and into the middle of the two on the right, crossing over the cords at the bottom, and take the right ones, bring them under and into the middle, crossing over the cords at the bottom once again. Once the bracelet is long enough, take one of the cords and tie it around to hold the others in place. The last thing to do is attaching the closure pieces and, as I said, I am using the magnetic clasps. And to glue them in place, I find that the glue that works best is epoxy. For this one, you're supposed to mix equal parts of both tubes, so I'm adding a drop of each and mixing them together. Then I just scrape the glue into the inside of the clasp and place the ends of the bracelet inside. Let it dry overnight and it's ready to wear! Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed this DIY! If you did, please give it a thumbs up to support the channel and comment down below which colors would you use to make these bracelets. I went for the blue and purple, but of course there are a ton more color combinations and I'm really curious to see which ones you would use. Also, make sure to subscribe if you are new to the channel and I'll talk to you soon. Bye!